still kind of a skid mount arrangement, if that, right. you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. um, so, and this is this is all stout here. That was the other thing. I think I ran a bolt down through here. I can't remember now. I might have ran a bolt down through here through the center of the bed, but that had good. These lined up somehow with the frame. I made some brackets or something under there so it would hook to the bottom of the frame. So I knew that even if the bed, bolts holding the bed on gave way, the whole frame and everything is going to have to go before we have to right. worry about it. You know, I just wanted to keep it as safe as we could. You know, we were trying to think of every potential oh, of course. possible. You, know, you wouldn't be able to live with yourself if someone got killed doing it. Mm -hmm. With your machine especially. <laughs> what, uh, now, that's the oil reservoir, right? That's the hydraulic oil reservoir. Hydraulic reservoir. Mm -hmm. Oil reservoir. Oil reservoir. There we yeah. go. <laughs> oh, fuel. Gasoline. Gasoline. What I used for gas is at the time I had this, I had a little um, a little boat, a little uh, fishing boat mm -hmm. with a portable tank with a quick disconnect on it. This is the fuel pump here. Just whatever you come up with, for it doesn't have its own gas tank. Okay. So either boat gas tank seemed to work well or whatever, and you just connect your line here. And when you turn it on, that's, that's all connected via the mm -hmm. electric over here, and that'll come on and give you, the, you know, your fuel pressure. And uh, there's also 12 volt, for what it's worth, there's a little 12 volt power source here if you want to plug in a spotlight or something. With a 12 volt socket right there. Oh, okay. okay. Ended up not using it, but we wanted to put it on there in case. You got a charge indicator gauge here for the alternator, so you know you're charging. And there's a hydraulic oil pressure gauge here. In here that's showing you you know you're pumping we changed when i did this i serviced it you know we put in all new oil put a new oil filter in it so all that stuff should be pretty good you know the hoses still look good they're not i use the best hoses